All right, gang, here we are doing another uh, test drive and walk around. This one, I gotta be honest, is a little hard to do because I've owned this car for quite a while. This is one of my personal cars. Uh, this is a TDI. It has never seen salt. It came out of a southern state, I believe it was Florida. And I've stored it in the winter. I've probably owned it five years or so. And we've done a lot of upgrades to it. It only has 62,000 miles. It was a low mileage car when I bought it and then it's just been kind of a summer toy. But it's time for it to move on. Tommy, what uh, what else can we say about this? I mean, this is... I think there's a lot we can say yeah. about it. You've treated it to some uh, tasteful things throughout the many years. So let's just start with that, I guess. it's uh, This car has been, shall we say, emissions altered. Yes. A lot of people would say deleted. So you don't have to deal with def, you don't have to deal with any of the diesel emission issues that you might see on a, a TDI or any diesel, modern diesel for that matter. Um, it's got a bigger turbo, it's got a tune. This is a DSG car and it has a transmission tune on the DSG as well. I'll just show the interior. The interior is really clean, it's a non-smoker. About the only pick on the entire car, I'll just get into that right now, is the headliner is starting to come loose, which is typical of a Volkswagen of this era. And it's uh, it's tacked up there uh, actually quite nicely, but if you don't like that, the car will need a, a headliner. Non-smoker. 17 inch, those are Renault wheels. They're freshly powder coated in a gunmetal color. A uh, good set of extreme contact sports. Those are a summer oriented tire and the car is sitting on H&R coilovers. So you can raise it, you can lower it. This is what, about the middle setting, Tommy? This is middle, maybe a little bit higher than the middle. So it actually gives you a pretty good ride. Yeah. You were it's just a, talking about that. It's a very comfortable ride. Um, you know, it has a, a sportier feeling, more like a, a GTI feeling than a normal, you know, yeah. Volkswagen Golf. Yeah. Tons of power. Uh, we got a Yakima rack here that comes with it. Uh, the windows have been smoked lightly, uh, tastefully in my opinion. Uh, we've got the hidden hitch back here uh, that I never used. I put it on for a bike rack and we just ne never ended up using it. Uh, and then I do have some grip tape here. This is for a dog that I used to have that passed away just so he could get in and out a little bit easier. I also have a set of Berber carpeted mats in here. We have a Ber Berber uh, cargo cover or cargo mat here. Seats fold flat. You can get all your gear and fun stuff in and get 45 miles to the gallon on a car, honestly, that's pretty quick. I suppose we should maybe pop the hood on this too. Another view of the wheels and tires. No center caps, but I know the VW Mark I Cabriolet and Scirocco center caps pop right in there if you want to run center caps. There she is in all of her glory. They don't make these anymore. And uh, pretty sweet these TDIs were and still are. And uh, there's a little picture of the turbo that's back there. We, we'll have the specs online of what it is. I believe it's a Borg Warner, if I remember right. And I, I'm thinking it was Malone it is tuning. A, it's a Malone Stage yeah. 3 tune. Yep. So for those of you out there that kind of know what we're talking about, uh, I assume this is going to go to another enthusiast. Let's go drive it, huh, Tommy? Let's get to the best part. to show this interior one time it is so clean i mean the driver's seat is in great condition Sixty-two thousand nine hundred and seventy-six. you can see we've got no warning lights on i'm gonna buckle my seat belt and uh, we've got no warning lights on whatsoever nor have any been on since I've owned the car. 
Good sound system in here as well. Volkswagen did a nice job with the touchscreen multimedia interface here. They really did, and that sound system honestly is better than the one I have in my Mark 7. <laughs> we'll let the guy go on the bike. He's an Iowa State fan. So that's about half pedal. You can see we're doing 35, 40 already going up the hill. Got plenty of power. The torquey power in these diesels is just such a fun car just to, to go around town or on the highway. It's not jerky. It just kind of gently pushes you back in your seat whenever you push down on that gas pedal. Oh yeah, it's a ton of fun. It's a ton of fun. And honestly, I've, ha I've had uh, these with three pedals, stick shifts, and uh, I'm a stick shift guy. Anybody that knows me knows that, but this DSG is really nicely paired with the torque of the TDI with just lightning quick shifts. I know the DSG has been tuned as well, and that makes it shift uh, so much nicer. Yeah. Um, if you've ever driven a stock one, this is gonna really treat you. Yeah. See, it's just effortless. This road's a little choppy, so that'll give us a little hint about the suspension. It's Tommy's right. It's it's a little bit more GTI than it's going to be Golf on the suspension. It's a little firmer, almost BMW esque, but does not beat you up at all. It's just a fun car to drive. I'm going to wait for traffic to clear a little bit because we're going to reel them in, and I'll give it maybe just a little bit more than half pedal. 50 60 and that's not on the floor so <laughs> and it's nice it's it's tuned it's quicker but it's quiet it's a yeah. diesel it's not loud it's not obnoxious i mean this is quieter than a stock new car diesel i feel like yeah you can put your grandma in here and she would have no idea you could drive her to the grocery store but once you drop her off you can hit the twisties and and hang with GTIs. I mean, it's a really fun, fun car to drive. And by the way, the range on it is like 600 miles because you're getting 45 miles to the gallon. <laughs> so, so if you're watching this from a little ways away, this is a nice, never seen salt, low mileage TDI wagon. These are getting hard to find, especially in this condition. This might be one of the nicer ones on the market, if not the nicest one. Um, what else can we say about it, Tommy? We can ship it right to your driveway. We'd love to earn your business. We've got books. Uh, it's kind of ready to go. Uh, if you're in the upper Midwest and you're concerned about the summer tires, we can throw in a set of winter wheels for winter use. Uh, you have your pick of one of two sets that we have. They won't come with tires, but we're kind of. I'm kind of a VW guy, so. There's You'll get a few extras if you want them with this car and uh, should be a great price for what's been done. I know we have tens of thousands in this car uh, just in terms of fun money. So uh, any questions that we didn't touch on, by all means, give us a call.